Hello and good evening. I'm Steve Eager. First on Fox 4 News at 5.30 tonight. Former Dallas City Councilman Dwayne Carraway ended months of speculation today and announced he is running against indicted County Commissioner John Wally Price for his commission seat. Fox 4's Sean Rapp spoke with both men today. Joins us now from our Dallas newsroom. Sean. Well, Steve, Dwayne Carraway not letting any grass grow under his political feet one day after his term ended on Dallas City Council. He is running again and hoping to run to a victory in another political campaign. Dwayne Carraway makes a step with the Townview drumline, telling supporters of his campaign announcement that he's going to make another step politically. Because I still believe that the dots in our region are not completely connected. After eight years on Dallas City Council, Dwayne Carraway setting his sights on a bigger seat. I am now officially a candidate for Dallas County Commissioner District 3. That's exactly. A seat held for 30 years by John Wiley Price. This particular bill. But Carraway says it's not a price fight. This is not going to be a race where it's um, the, the battle of the Goliaths. That, that's not the issue. It is what can we do to enhance and bring greater and better opportunities to the people in which live in this region and in this county. The county doesn't do bags, and we don't do pull up pants. We, we, we run operations here. With the swipe at the controversial plastic bag ban pushed by Caraway and his efforts against sagging pants, Price, the first and only African-American county commissioner, confident he can turn back all comers, including Caraway. The last time I think I had three opponents, and uh, I won by 77%. I thought I commented, not guilty. But the last time, Price was not under federal indictment for public corruption. Not guilty. That obviously is going to play a factor. Dallas attorney Victor Vidal, not involved in the Price case, but says the trial, set to start in January 2016, could be unfinished business as voters vote in the primary next March. The last big case we had, and this one is uh, reputed to be even larger than the Don Hill case, took over three months to try, so there's the very real prospect that the uh, primary uh, runs contemporaneous with the latter part of the trial. Price undaunted. I definitely plan to run for re-election. With mariachis, music, and more, Caraway hoping to find the right beat to win the commissioner's seat in District 3. We still have more to gain and more to achieve. Well, certainly promises to be an interesting campaign season. A lot of faces in the crowd today, but not the elected Democrats who've in the past supported both men, Steve. They're staying on the sidelines right now. And both men over the years at odds politically disagree again on who should represent the people of District 3 at Commissioner's Court. You're right. It'll be interesting. Sean Rabb, thank you. Okay.